Wrexham, Wales. Wrexham is a city of Wrexham County Borough in Wales. It is located between the Welsh Mountains and the Lower Dee Valley, near the border with Cheshire in England. Wrexham has historically been one of the primary settlements of Wales with documented activity since the Bronze Age. Wrexham was developed in the Middle Ages as a regional centre for trade and administration. The town was particularly well known in the 14th and 15th centuries for the manufacture of Welsh bucklers. A buckler is a small shield, up to 18 inches in diameter. The end of Welsh independence occurred in the 13th century during the conquest of Wales by Edward I. Later, in the 16th century, the Acts of Union passed during the reign of Henry VIII which caused Wales to be incorporated into the realm of the Kingdom of England. Note, the Commonwealth was the political structure during the period from 1649 to 1660 when England and Wales, later along with Ireland and Scotland, were governed as a republic after the end of the Second English Civil War and the trial and execution of Charles I. Wrexham became the most populous settlement in Wales in the 17th century. During the Industrial Revolution starting in the 18th century, the city and surrounding area were a hub of coal and lead mining. The air also included production of iron, steel, leather and brewing. The entrepreneur John Wilkinson, known as Iron Mad Wilkinson, opened Bersham Iron Works to kickstart the Industrial Revolution in Wrexham. By the mid-19th century, there were 19 breweries in and around the town. The breweries benefited from good underground water supplies in Wrexham. Wrexham Lager Brewery was established in 1882 and became the first brewery in the United Kingdom to produce lager beer. In the early 20th century, the North East Wales coalfield was producing up to 3 million tonnes a year and employed over 10,000 people. In 1934, the Gresford Colliery had 2,200 miners working in three eight-hour shifts. As there was a football match on the Saturday afternoon between Wrexham and Tranmere Rovers, on Friday 21 September, many miners doubled up the shifts so they could attend the match. This meant there were more miners down the pit than there ordinarily would have been. An underground explosion occurred at around 2 a.m. which led to the death of 266 men with only six survivors. The mine owners docked the men half a day's pay, as they had not completed a full day's shift. Nine years after the closure of the pit, in 1982 the headgear wheel was preserved as part of the Gresford Disaster Memorial. The Gresford Colliery was located near the village of Gresford, near Wrexham. However, the industry went into decline after the First World War, with the last pit to close was Bersham Colliery in 1986. Wrexham's economy has moved away from heavy industry to high-tech manufacturing, biotechnology, finance and professional services. The city is noted for hosting Wrexham AFC, one of the oldest professional football teams in the world. At the 2021 census, it had an urban population of over 44,000. Wrexham finally received city status in September 2022 after four attempts. The historic city centre contains a large number of listed buildings set on a medieval street pattern radiating out from the parish church of St Giles which was the focal point around which the city developed. The church precinct, and the surrounding narrow enclosed streets and alleyways retain a medieval character. Several complete medieval buildings survive on Town Hill and Church Street. St Giles's parish church is the parish church of Wrexham. The church is recognised as one of the finest examples of ecclesiastical architecture in Wales. The iconic 16th century tower rises to a height of 136 feet and is a local landmark that can be seen for many miles around. It forms one of the seven wonders of Wales. St Giles's occupies a site of continuous Christian worship for at least 800 years. It is widely considered to be among the greatest of the medieval buildings still standing in Wales. It has one of the oldest brass eagle lecterns in Britain. The racecourse ground is a football stadium in Wrexham, Wales. It is the home of Wrexham Association Football Club, AFC. It is the world's oldest international football stadium that still hosts international matches, having hosted Wales' first home international match in 1877. Wrexham Association Football Club is a professional association football club based in Wrexham. Formed in 1864, it is the oldest club in Wales and the third oldest professional association football team in the world. Wrexham AFC has a rocky historical performance, primarily bouncing between Division 3 and 4. A notable exception was during the 1978-1981 seasons where they briefly attained Division 2 status. 
In 2008, Wrexham were finally relegated to non-league status following a 2-0 defeat at Hereford United, ending the club's 87-year stay in the Football League. In November 2020, Canadian-American actor Ryan Reynolds and American actor Rob McElhenney bought the club. On the 22nd of April 2023, Wrexham secured winning their first league title in 45 years, and were promoted to the English Football League 2 after a 15-year absence, following a 3-1 win against Boreham Wood. Hope you enjoyed the brief history of Wrexham. Do you have any interesting facts about Wrexham to share? If so, please leave them in the comments.